गरिया के खुश होंगे तो गरिया लीजिए चाचा ये जो झगड़ा चला रहा है इसको बंद करिए ना झगड़ा तुम्हारे अबू ने शुरू किया था चाचा देखिए वैसे तो हमारे दादा को आपके दादा ने गाँव से निकाला था ना अभी झगड़ा शुरुआत कहाँ से हुआ ये सब खोजते बैठेंगे तो कभी खत्म नहीं होगा कभी न कभी तो एक होना पड़ेगा कहने कहा जाते हो यही कि हम लोग का मजहब एक है हम लोग कमा भी तो एक करते हैं सेम टू सेम तो प्यार मोहब्बत से समझ लेते हैं ये खून खराबा करके काम मिलेगा किसी को बताइए तुम्हारे अबू मानेंगे
चमकदार नहीं होता न जाने बन में कितने फूल खिले हैं हर फूल चमकदार नहीं होता Adam Ji. मेरे को भी आगना है जल्दी आ दूसरे उसमें हगले अब दूसरे उसमें हगले ना जा कैसे आ गया आर्थर आर्थर फोर्स आई टोल्ड यू इट वाज अ सेटअप ड्रेस माय बॉय माय डियर बॉय व्हाट दे गॉट मी आई गॉट अवे या या यू डिड Mr. Scrimshaw, I need help. Reverend Swanson. He's gonna set the law on us. No, of course he was. I'm sorry, Arthur. It is a bit late for apologies. Swanson. Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan, you're safe now. Oh, let's get him to bed. You are safe now, Arthur. Okay. I got you. You're safe now. That's pretty. That's that's real pretty. Miss Grimshaw, will you sit with him a while? Of course. You'll be okay, Mr. Morgan. You're home. <laughs> कुछ गलती हो गया है काम अली ये दुश्मन के यहाँ रिश्ता जोड़ के उसे पॉलिटिक्स बता रहे हो तुम सरदार खान के यहाँ भी हो रहा है ना और इसीलिए जिंदा भी है वो तो अब तो सेहरा भी बंधेगा बिरयानी भी बनेगी कबूल है कबूल है ये उनका कबूल है ना
Good morning, Arthur. Hey, Shady. So you didn't get Como Driscoll? No. And I'm feeling better, by the way. All right, well, I should be getting on. Sure. Fire's good and hot, Mr. Morgan. You okay? Thank you for all your work. Of course, Mr. Morgan. Listen, Morgan. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I, I thought they would shoot me, not you. What happened? Yeah, the whole thing was odd. I kept waiting for, for them to jump us. And then they left, and we so, assumed Sultan? we'd meet you on the trail back. Hey, Sultan! Hey! Hey! Hey, get out of here! Abe! Get out of here! Get out of here! Abe, lock it up! Hey, sorry! Abe! Abe, what are you doing? Go! Abe, no one sees you. Bora, what are you doing? One time, I tried to be wise and careful and make a goddamn fool of myself. That'll teach me. Think of the boy and make plans. Wish John was. I care about him. Mr. Morgan. Can I ask you a favor? It, if it's convenient, I mean. Sure. Jack needs you come. If you're out on your adventures and you see any herbs for seasoning, would you mind grabbing them for me? Seasoning? Yes. Don't tell Mr. Pearson. <laughs> okay. I'll see what I can do. How you doing? You did good with that graze business. Okay. Like I told you, I was born, born in down manor houses. I could say the same. You just sit, you know. Are you busy, Arthur? सुल्तान हमरी आपसी रंजिश का फायदा रामाधीर सिंह उठा रहा है अरे वो का कब आता है उसी दूर से अरे सलम नहीं आता आपको सरीफ पूरे सी की औलाद हैं सुल्ताना डाकू के अंग्रेजों का गार्ड फटता था उनसे और आप हैं कि खाली सकल पाया है देखो इनको देखा जिक्र नहीं है इनके पास पर यहाँ बुलाई करने का कोई मतलब नहीं What expenses? Gentlemen's canes and rabbits to pull out of hats? Among other things, I had quite a nice little business going for a while. Shares in a gold mining company. Excellent returns for the investor of a certain financial standing. Until, well, that unfortunate run-in with the law. Yeah, that's how it goes. Thanks for disappearing on us during that Sean business, by the way. I'd done my part. 
Each to their strengths, dear boy. You know, you boys should really watch yourselves with those two families. This is a small town. People talk. I tried to mention it to Osea, but you know how he is. Anyway, while they're off chasing their pot of Confederate gold hidden at the end of some rainbow, here we are. We can hitch up outside. I'll make the introductions, Arthur. back a bit and let me do the talking. We don't want to scare... Oh, I almost forgot. Bill asked me to give you a message to meet him here in town as soon as you can. Something to do with craze. I thought I'd nab you first. You did? Okay. Thanks. Hello, Alden. Hello, Josiah. How have you been? Dandy. And you, friend? Uh, like I said, times are tough. My missus is a bad woman. Terrible woman. They often are. But how's work, Alden? Terrible. Wages got cut again. They reckon they just invented a new horse's carriage will be the end of us. <laughs> They've been saying that nonsense since they invented the wheel. The witness of bosses. I know. My comrades here and I are greatly discouraged from the adequate fulfillment of our duty. A discouraged man is no man at all, Alden. No man at all. My friend Arthur here has a present for you. Ain't you kind, sir? Call him Martha. He's one of us, a fellow man of distinction. Okay. Well, this is perfect timing. I think you'll like this one, Josiah. It'll be coming south down the river road through Siltwater Strand. Thank you, Alden. Thank you very much. Oh, and Josiah, if you or Arthur are ever out Strawberry Way, ask for my colleague there feller called Hector. He's also one of the... What did you call us again? Discouraged men, Alden. That's it. Discouraged men. I like that. Well, goodbye, Alden. Or should I say... Adieu. Oh, adieu, Josiah. <laughs> what the hell was that? I thought you might like to see that pantomime. River Road through Siltwater Strand, he said. Okay. I think I know a good spot to wait. Follow me. Don't surprise me in the least. Okay, let's go. This way. What did I tell you? Simple as can be. Seems a lot of the station workers are in on it these days. Earning a pittance, the unions are whipping them up, so they want something on the side. Like he said, there, strawberry, could create a lot of opportunities for a man in your line of work. I ain't sure about going back to Strawberry after all that market business. Didn't sound like you left anyone alive to recognize you, so I wouldn't worry too much, dear boy. All this trouble, you gentlemen are becoming quite the celebrities, aren't you? Soon you'll be on the front of a dime novel. And dead, of course. We're hoping to be long gone for that. Dutch has a plan. Here we are. This is the spot. Oh. I'm going to have to 
आपकी तरह नहीं है हम अरे जाके कोठा खोल दो सरदार के दरबार में जाओ तभी से बात करो तभी ये बात सिखाइए हमको Better safe than sorry. What were you thinking? Well, according to this, the loot is located in a strong box, which is in the back. I'll put on a little performance, and you can scurry around, open the strong box, and relieve them of their goodies. And how do I open the strong box without threatening someone to open it for me? This should work. <laughs> and I can do this silently? Well, I'm hoping complete silence won't be necessary. But you're going to wish you had your earplugs. This is Damson. Oh, very good, old and very good. Of course, if anything goes wrong, you can wave your guns around like you normally do. Hold tight. They'll be here soon. There it is, right on time. Let's go. Keep your distance so they don't see you, and please leave that gun in its holster for once. don't know anything about culture. I couldn't agree more. Would, could, could you? It's, it's such a small show, but would you sing something for me? I, I'm looking for a mezzo soprano. Uh, I, 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 I don't know. Miss Damson, you owe it to West Elizabeth. I've heard enough. Might I have your card? The event is on the 23rd of this month. I can't say enough. Uh, Mrs. Damson. Magnifico. So sorry, gentlemen, for the interruption. Farewell. Well done, sir. Well done. It was easy. You did all the work. Teamwork, my dear boy. Teamwork. Here you go. Thank you. Oh, jolly good. Go see Alden from time to time. 
See you soon, Arthur. Time to go, boy. You're looking real nice today, Bill. Shut up. <laughs> Been waiting for you, Arthur. Well, I'm sorry to have kept you. Come on, let's get going. What's the plan? We're meeting a couple of the Greys over at the saloon. They spoke to Bill about a job, needing security. After the farce of stealing the horses for them, why are we doing this? Because we need to stay in with them, and they're paying. So what kind of security they want? We're about to find out. Now come on. This seemed legit to you, Bill. Sure. Dutch said we was to keep on dealing with them until we find this gold. Can we trust them? Can we trust anyone? Yeah. Let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them horses. And what did they board in their fields? They don't know we had anything to do with that. Oh, uh, that's so. Yeah. They think it was the Braithwaite's. Listen, I know these great boys a bit now. This is on the level. We're stuck in the middle of some ancient feud, but instead of playing both sides, we're being used by both of them. They were saying that Catherine Braithwaite... Hey, hold up. This don't feel right. Now it don't feel right? I could have told you... Get
Only Grays I see left around here is you. You want us to come out? We'll come out. Get off, Bill. Guns on the ground now. Both of you. Don't do it. You know we can't do that. You put the gun down, Chef. I'll blow his brains out. You want to join your little friend there, do you? Either way, you're a dead man. Morgan? Well, how the hell was I to know? Let me see. They set us up once before. They didn't like us. We destroyed their farm. Na koi kisi ka rakib hota hai. Na koi kisi ka habib hota hai. Khuda ki rehmat se ban jate hain rishte jahan jiska naseeb hota hai. Oh, nobody but yourself! Oh, you act so high and mighty, but you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what? Six months now? And all you ever done was complain. You can fight, but you can't think. You can't do either. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Bill, take the boy's body. Bury him proper someplace quiet. <clears throat> Micah! Best you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm just so frightened by you. Get out of my sight, pair of fools. He was like an annoying little brother to me. What fun we had riding together. What a god. Damn mess we are making of things. <laughs>